How you guys doing? In reference to my identity and my mother and father's identity, most people know that my parents are very attractive individuals. My mother was attractive. My father was attractive. There are legends in Hollywood history and in the modeling industry. And my parents was involved in fashion designing in the fashion modeling industry. And my mother and father possibly owned some clothing stores and companies. Look up that information too. And in reference to my mother and father, my looks of who I am came from my biological parents. Not from these impersonators. I've never had no plastic surgery. My face is real. My nose is real. My teeth are real. So all these people that made up these lies that have damaged my face, trying to make me look like these, the, a child of these other people, those people got to go into court. I'm not their child. And these government people that have been burning me from satellite need to go into court. They are trying to belittle the identity of my biological parents. I lived with my real parents. I grew up with my real parents. And I got kidnapped and held hostage in Indiana by these other people. These people are obviously tied in with somebody in government. I'm not from their family. My looks came from my mother and father. That satellite man is trying to do hiccups. And government man, I don't drink. So if you're trying to play this uh, hiccup game or trying to make somebody stutter, accusing somebody of alcoholism, you're going to get possibly put in the electric chair. I'm not going to play your game, man. You've been hitting me in the teeth accusing me of things. All my money's accounted for. So when you make up lies about finances or your accusations about alcohol, when alcohol is legal, and I don't even drink, but I have a legal right to drink, but in reference to the information of you trying to make me stutter by hitting me in the teeth and hitting me in the throat and hitting me in the mouth and the face, all my expenditures are accounted for. So you're going to need to go into court for hitting me in the teeth and damaging my teeth and face. You need to go to court, government man. And so does that woman. I don't know if it's that woman that's uh, from the MAD organization, Mothers Against Drunk Drivers or something. And I guess she's a satellite controller or something. And she's been torturing Americans, fabricating lies on people. See if that's the lady in the satellite control room. If you've damaged my teeth, lady, you're getting life in prison. And you can, you can get put on trial for the death penalty. I'm not playing nobody's tricks or accusations. You need to go into court. They're hitting me in the teeth right there. And all you drug enforcement agents, if you ever accused me of drugs... You're going to need to go to court, and you can get put on trial for the death penalty. And in reference to the accusations of when my parents got murdered or when my parents died, these people fabricated drug overdoses. My father didn't do drugs. My mother didn't do drugs either. And we need the name of every one of those people that made up those lies because a toxicology test proved that my mother and father did not do drugs. So in reference to the activities of these government people, every single person that accusated against my mother and father must be subpoenaed into court. Oh, so in reference to the other point, do not, uh, do not accuse me of being these other people's child because a satellite man damaged my face trying to make me look like one of their children. When the royal protocol is my birth certificate in the media and I'm an only child of my parents. So don't call me the child of these other people. And hello, celebrity families, many friendly acknowledgments of things. Hollywood A-list families of friends and things. Lots of things of importance. I'm talking about the people holding me hostage, the people burning my face and teeth with satellites, the people that's tried to steal my penis size, people that tried to steal my blood and sperm, and people that's been stealing my money, holding me hostage, or they've been stealing 
monies and benefits that I was supposed to have received and they've been blocking me from my lawsuit monies with these other people trying to claim that they thought I was their child no I got kidnapped from my mother and father's mansion the people that are trying to claim that they thought I was their child they didn't own the mansions of my mother and father my mother and father owned their own mansions so people need to go into court. And these government people belittling my identity means they're trying to steal mansions. They're trying to play confusion games. Now what's the value of their lies? What are they trying to bring to the table? Extortion? Fraud? Theft? What's their family history? Meaning, not on my table, but in reference to their lies and tricks... What are they trying to steal? What's their net worth of what their their scam is? And what's their net worth before they stole monies from me? They just hit me in the mouth. So what is their value? Now don't forget, all my expenditures are accounted for. So in reference to these people making up alcohol accusations, and don't forget, I'm one of the top athletes in the world. So in reference to these people misrepresenting the facts uh, and their accusations of drugs or alcohol, you need to go into court. And, and when did you think somebody uh, bought drugs or when did you think somebody bought alcohol? Every time I've ever bought alcohol is on record. You, I've never bought drugs, never done drugs either. So you're going to need to go into court no matter who you are. And the American Dentist Association could possibly put you in the electric chair for damaging my teeth and face. You have to see that in court, I guess.